Hi, welcome to Tech Tricks Tutorial. Today, we're going to show you how to use Tome AI for presentation. It's a step-by-step -step beginner guide for everyone to follow easily. If you find this tutorial helpful, please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Now, let's get right into it. Tome AI is a valuable tool that can help you deliver impactful presentation with ease. In this tutorial, we will focus on the basics of using Tome AI to enhance your presentation skills. By the end of this tutorial, you'll have a solid understanding on how to use Tome AI to create amazing presentation. So, uh, let's get started. Now, the first thing you're going to do to access Tome AI is go to beta.tone.app or you can simply go to another tab and search for Tome AI. And you will be able to see this first link over here and you're simply going to click this to be able to access Tome AI. Now what you're going to do next is you're going to create an account by clicking on sign in over here. And you will be able to see a pop up that says sign in or sign up. You're going to go with the sign up and you can sign up with your email or connect it with your Google account. After signing up, you will be able to see this page over here. Now I'm going to give you a quick tour to our page right now so that you will be able to be familiar with what you are going to deal with. Over here on the left side, you will be able to see notification for your toe, recents, the recent presentations that you have created, which is what we are seeing right now, your personal in this section, personal presentations that you have created, you have shared with me, basically presentations that are shared with, shared with you by other people, and you also have your company over here. You can also see your deleted presentations in the deleted section. You will be able to invite teammates or people to work with you with your presentation by clicking on invite teammates over here and you will be able to invite members using their email over here. You can simply type in their email and then click on invite over here. You can invite them as an admin or a member over here depending on what you would like to have. Now in creating a presentation, you're simply going to click on create over here on the top right. Now using this AI is not an unlimited use. You will be able to use this for a limited amount of time. As you can see here on the bottom left, we have AI credits. The more we create presentation, the more we will use up our credits. As you can see here for the free plan that we are currently using, we could create unlimited term creation for individuals. But as you can see, it will only have 500 AI credits per person. AI credits meaning that we will be able to use the AI functionalities of Tome AI only limited for 500 credits and the more we use it, the more pages we create with the Tome AI, the more credits will be taken from us. But as you can see, you will be able to use Tome for as many as you want, as many presentation as you want, as long as you are the one who are creating the content. You will be able to have 50 Tomes per workspace and for 2 people. You could also upgrade to Pro which is $8 which is billed mon monthly or annually if you would like. And you will be able to have unlimited tome creation, unlimited AI computer credits, and everything is free such as export to PDF and remove tome branding, add custom logos, and have priority support. On the enterprise, you would need to contact them for the list the for the pricing. But as you can see here, there will be more features available for you. So we're going to start creating our presentation to create a presentation you're simply going to click on create over here on the top right by clicking that we would be redirected to this page over here where we will be able to create our presentation as you can see here right away we will be able to see this section over here you will be able to see different features or different options that you could do like send us a message if you would like to help if you would like to get some help you could open the get started guide to be able to be guided on how to use Tome. You could also have prompt writing tips over here, rename Tome, copy Tome link, and all of this option. There's also set team. You could also connect different platforms to this Tome presentation of yours. You could add Jiffy, you could add Figma, you could add Miro over here. Different platforms that you could add, different tiles. Tiles are basically like sections in your page, like a different columns for your page. And you will be able to add these different platforms to your presentations as well. 
You can also uh, table, video, image, text over here by simply clicking on them. As you can see, this is an example of a tile. One of this is a tile. Right now, we have two columns or two tiles in our specific page. And you could add more tiles by clicking on this button over here or over here on this section over here. Maybe we would like to add another image tile. And just like that, we now have three tiles. We have our heading, title, and our image over here. You could rearrange them by simply dragging them around. Just like this. And right now, the the title and heading is below. You could also do this. And now our image is on the front part. You could add more things like image, image style, page about, image style, and all of this information. You could also add AI image title over here, which AI image style, which is an AI generated image. You could also make it automatically create a page about for you here click on create page about and you can simply put in what the page is about for example you would like to create a page about dogs and you would like the ai to create it for you, you can simply type in dog click on enter and as you can see right now our balance is 275 so it would take credits from us as you can see the more we use our ai as you can see here we have our ai generated over here and their content generated over here now, if you do want to use the AI, you can simply do that over here. You can type whatever prompt that you would like to have, like create a presentation about the dogs, those kind of stuff. But you could also do it the old-fashioned way, like add images, add text, add titles, add all of those stuff manually. And you can take advantage of the easy-to-use feature or UI of AI Dome over here. You can simply delete this for the meantime. Let's start from... Let's, let's start fresh and click on add text over here. We're going to click on add text and we can change this style to title and we can delete this. You could click this and you will be able to see the settings over here like the alignment, uh, the center over here. You could move this for now. Over here as you can see we have our title. We can change it to body or make it list. For our title we can go with testing for now. And we will be able to edit our color over here by clicking this button over here. You can change this to any theme that you would like to have for your dome over here. You could have edit the page itself over here. You can change it to light, canary, and all of those stuff. We're going to stick with dark. You can also edit the color for your heading over here, the paragraph, bold over here, auto color, all of those stuff. You could also record your camera or microphone if you would like to say something and it will automatically type it in whatever you would like to say we're not going to try that out right now because it's going to interact with our recording and make a mess so we're going to ignore that right now you will be able to add pages over here on the left side you can click on new page and you will be able to choose from all of this layout you have your heading paragraph over here title heading paragraph with a photo heading with a table over here uh, photo three photos photos with the heading and paragraph and title over here or you could simply create a new page without choosing any of those title by simply clicking on the plus page once again and you will be able to create something new just like this and you could edit them by clicking here maybe you would like to add a table and you will be able to have two sections over here two columns we have our heading and our table over here you could do all of the styles over here, the functionalities over here. You can simply search here also if you are being lost. Or, like I said earlier, you could ask it to create an entire presentation for you by using the AI. To create it, you're simply going to do this once again. And you could, over here on the top part, you're going to look for create presentation about over here. And you're simply going to put in your topic or whatever presentation theme or topic you would like to have. For example, create a presentation about the importance of taking care of the environment. Just like that. And then click on enter. And as you can see, our total balance right now is 250. Earlier, it was 275. And it took 25 credits from us, so it's not going to take much. You could still be able to create a lot of things. So we're going to wait for it to finish creating. As you can see here on our back page, you will be able to see how much it's creating. 
as you can see here it already started from this page on page 4 we have our title over here another section over here another page in this section with AI generated image their paragraph over here with a good introduction more information in this section and just like that continuously it used AI generated images to create their own presentation over here and after creating your presentation you could click on the play over here on the top right and you could move the pages around by clicking on the arrow key on your keyboard you could also share this to other people if you would like over here you will be able to add their emails in this section or you could copy the link of your presentation over here you could change what they can do you can change it to no access or can play over here you could also link it to a current page if you would like or have a QR code generated for your specific presentation. And that's it guys. That's how you can use Tome AI to create a presentation just for you. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.